sun was setting behind the mountains the dew was fallen upon the leaves and I was seated beside a fountain a feathered songster sang on a tree with love and blisses his notes were sounding made me reminded of days of yore wherein a bower i picked a flower and i dreamt of edward on loch erin shore oh the cuckoo's notes in the air is sounding a peal so pleating and pleasing here and every note is a bliss abounding here in the valley if he were here each step i take by the winding river where we have wandered in days of yore reminds me of edward my banished lover and left me lonely on Loch Erin shores Oh, a crop of sorrow My heart is reaping My rose has faded And my hopes decayed For it's in the night time when all are sleeping awake i am weeping till the break of day delight has fled me and woe has wed me why did you leave me my love a storm for love compelled him and banished Edward and left me lonely on Loch Erin shores oh could I move like send a sigh o'er the distant deep or could i move like a bird in motion by my edward's side i would ever keep I'd fondly soothe him with songs, amuse him. I'd gently soothe him, he'd sigh no more. And seven years would soon pass over and we'd both live happy on 
Loch Erin Shore.
One day as I went on my ramble From Swinford to Sweet Ballylee I met a fair maid on my ramble And her name it was Mary McGee and she sighed for the love of our country. Michael David, her true Irish boy, who is now in a prison of Portland, far from the lovely sweet banks of the Moy. I quickly approached this fair maiden, asked her what was the cause of her woe, and what was the cause of her misery, which forced her to leave her own home. She said, for the rights of my country, Michael David, my true Irish boy, is now in a prison of Portland, far from the lovely sweet banks of the Moy. Don't talk of that sweet sixty-seven. We had brave men and true men, you know. There was young Peter Carney, God bless him, who died in Killarney also. He was drilled by my darling Mick David in the valleys and plains of Dermoy. That is why he's a prisoner in Portland, far from the lovely sweet banks of the Moy. So now to conclude and to finish, I hope that the day will soon come when those cruel landlords and villains from the Isle of St. Patrick must run. We will unfurl our green and gold banner and we'll wave it for Ireland on high and we'll toast to that brave Michael David from the lovely sweet banks of the Moy. Thank you.
until you're bathed you to hold air and shore forevermore and your own sweet Colleen Goo oh, is now they tell how you won your on Flanders' bloodstained plain, and how you fought with the old brigade when the bullets fell like rain. Ah, you were brave on Limerick Bridge, that day I stood by you. That day you stood Need smoke and blood By the side of your Colleen room When the traveller heard those mournful words They pierced him to the core that made he knew he had loved so well he had loved in days of yore he pushed aside the bushes there until she came in view he pressed 